Fox exclusive Fight for Life. This local Marine believes he got terminal cancer while serving in the Gulf War. But getting health benefits from the government turned out to be a battle on its own. We fight to have a better country so we can have the things that we do. It shouldn't be that um, after you serve your country, you have to fight the government. After Eyewitness News looked into his story, we've learned the government has agreed to help cover his medical expenses and beyond. Reporter Alex DePrado joins us live with details you'll see only on Eyewitness News. Well, Karen, doctors say Jose Belliard only has about three years to live, but a new ruling from the VA means Belliard's kids will have insurance and an education when he's no longer here. They only put a few things that I turned Jose Belliard waited two years for the phone call. It was something that... Um, I just couldn't believe my ears. It's the end of a long battle for this Gulf War veteran. I was shaking, crying, everything that uh, you would imagine. The director of the Providence VA calling Belliard personally to tell him he's been granted full benefits for non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Belliard says he developed the cancer spreading a chemical on Iraqi prisoners to kill lice. The VA's decision means his medical costs are covered and his three children will have an education when he's gone. The best gift I can give my kids is a college education. If I would have still been around, I would have been working towards that. It's a decision that Belliard knew he had to keep fighting for. It hasn't been easy, but at least I, I can... I can breathe a little better. Belliard hopes his case will serve as a wake-up call for how our country treats its veterans. It is amazing that someone who serves their country has to wait that long for their family to get relief. But most of all, he says he'll enjoy being able to do more with his family now that he's not paying for his cancer treatments on his own. My kids don't have to save their allowance and take their father to the movies anymore. I can take him to the movies. In a statement tonight, the VA tells Eyewitness News Belliard's case was complicated because his cancer is so rare. Belliard has been granted the full benefits he requested for his cancer diagnosis.